Forget struggling to find a Wi-Fi connection, the future of high-speed internet could lie in space. A number of companies, including Facebook, Google and SpaceX, are battling it out to be the first to provide a global Wi-Fi network for everyone. But the tech giants could be beaten by a relative unknown, UK-based OneWeb. The company just received a half a billion dollar boost from a group of investors including Airbus, Virgin and Qualcomm. The plan is to launch 648 small-scale satellites into low orbit, which would in theory provide a single global Wi-Fi network at 3G speeds. We have the funding, we have the spectrum, we have the launch and the launch timing all set up. We have the manufacturing capability with Airbus. We have that oh so important chip technology from Qualcomm mm -hmm. that allows us to hand over and talk within the satellites and to reach out to the mobile phones, tablets and and computers that individuals will already have in the emerging markets. The total cost of the project is estimated at $2 billion. Google launched its own version of satellite-based internet in 2013, dubbed Project Loon. It uses helium-filled balloons which would beam down the internet to the developing world. Google also recently purchased Titan Aerospace, which manufactures drones. The tech giant believes that one day it could use these drones instead of balloons. Facebook, which was also hoping to buy Titan, is developing its own solar-powered drones which could stay in the sky for up to five years. All this stratospheric activity means the sky above is becoming increasingly crowded, but OneWeb CEO thinks there's plenty of room. It's a race in this only in the sense that getting connectivity to people is important, but there's many, many opportunities for connectivity across many different types of infrastructure. The one thing all these companies have in common though, providing the internet as a tool for education in third world countries. A cause that's close to musician Will I Am's heart. You know, I know, I know what, that, what that's like firsthand, seeing how it, connectivity has changed the ghetto that I'm from. Um, that connected with, you know, getting kids up to speed building robots and, and writing code. If people can do that in Rwanda and the Philippines and Uruguay and Paraguay, that, that's the reason why I'm drawn to OneWeb and the vision is uh, every school connected. So from the sky to your phone, the broadband space race is on. Hey YouTube fans, I'm Landon Downey from CNBC. Thanks so much for checking out our channel. Here you'll find videos packed with all the info that you need to be smarter about your finances. Be sure and subscribe by clicking right here and click on all the videos around me to see CNBC's original series, Young Money, Tech Bet, Kramer's Mad Money, and all the latest from CNBC.